there. Around two miles separates the two teams meeting tonight on Austin Childers Field. The FPD Vikings and Stratford Academy Eagles looking to head into the playoffs with a field full of momentum. <laughs> and yeah, on the one side, you've got Stratford folks with the white out and a little red, white, and blue for the Vikings fans. Time oh, yeah. for some touchdowns. We begin with Stratford's Keandre Glover. First possession for the Eagles, and Glover's gliding into the end zone for the touchdown. Extra point was good. A little dance there. Oh, Seven yeah. nothing. Stratford. Vikings ball. Jakari Williams. Strong arm. Powerful legs. Boom. Rushing with the ball. Running over Williams people. Finally forced out of, out of bounds. Deep in Stratford territory. And then it's Williams reaching Williams the ball into the end the zone score. for a touchdown. Oh. We are tied at seven. Eagles turn. Sean Wilmore dives into the next move into the end zone. Two possessions. Okay. Two touchdowns for Stratford, 14-7. Vikings turn, or shall I say, Jakari Williams turn. It's the green. Going. The green. Going. Yeah. Money green, baby. Going, going. Uh, the junior quarterback is in. We are tied <laughs> at 14. Late second quarter. Stay Williams to his chest. favorite target. Watch Carter Hayes. Woo! Check out that catch. He just went up and On snatched it. Head. He's only a junior. And that sets up the shovel pass to Carter Hayes, who's going to Bounces his way into the end zone for the score. 21-14 Vikings at the half, and Victor is excited. Second half, though, the Eagles' offense would explode. It starts on the kickoff when Sean Wilmore gets a couple of blocks, bounces off one tackler, and uh -oh. then takes off. A pass midfield finally dragged down from behind. Nicely done. But the Wilmore return would set up Keandre Glover. Touchdown Ooh. there. Fireworks all over the place. And when the final tally rings out, scoreboard will show us Stratford gets the win 49-40. Mr. Jones.